the spots from the house in the schedule. Bro. That's how I need to June 1. That's how I need to June 1. <laughs> Eddie, drop the knowledge, man. What's going on, though? Things are good. Things are very busy. Got a big show on Saturday night, double uh, world title header. And obviously, next week in Philly, double world championship header as well with uh, Magic Zulecki as well. It's going to be a great fight. I'm very excited about all of it. A lot of people ask me, is he going to be the co main event on that card? Is it. Uh... No, he's it's, it's going to be the. Uh, there's three fight, main yeah. fights, so he's going to be on. You got uh, uh, Katie Farmer against Carol. Yep. Katie Taylor unification, and then Sulecki Rosado. So what's that's going to be on at like nine ten o'clock? Yeah, oh. half nine, something like that. So nice, nice and late in the card. How was ticket sales and everything going off? Good. That yeah, we're going to have. I think we'll have a close to six thousand in there on the night, which is great for Tevin. You know, homecoming fight. Beautiful. Uh, Friday night in Philly, St. Patrick's Day weekend. So all looking good, ready to go. All these cars you got going down over mm. here, man. I mean. You gotta be a happy man. It's going well, you know, like, look, whenever you come into a new market, no one really wants you to succeed. But I think, you know, with the schedule we've got coming up now with Bivol against Joe Smith, Booker against Lespierre, Farmer Carroll, Katie Taylor, Sulecki against Rosado, then you've got like, Ryan Garcia headlining, then you've got Rung Visay against Estrada, great fight, the Henny against Roman Unification, Jesse Vargas on the same night, then you've got Canelo against Jacobs, then you've got the return of Usyk, then you've got Joshua against Miller. Like, this is just up till like literally the end of May, first week of June. So you can't miss it. I'm unrivaled, in my opinion, show me all the other platforms and show me their schedules and show me a better schedule than this. I don't believe it exists. I see you back and forth on Twitter and war with Espinosa, man. Situations going down with the Beyonce Wilder, some contracts here and there. Drop the notch. What is going on with that whole situation? Nothing really. I mean, look, you know, I think Espinosa's a little bit salty because he lost Joshua. And I think, you know, Wilder's come out and said that he's not with Showtime. So at the end of the day, the past the past. I just want to get the fights made. You know, so I'm not going to say too much about it, only hopefully everyone can sit down. You know, hopefully Joshua can beat Miller. Hopefully Wilder can beat Brazil and that fight can get made for November, December. You put out some info saying that you want Wilder versus Adam Kronoski, something about 15 million you want to... Is that true? Is that yeah, I mentioned a whole group of guys like Brazil, Kanowski, uh, Dillian White as well. Looks like he's going to have to fight Brazil in his mandatory. And, um, you know, we'll see what happens. Now, Kanowski, man, what would you like seeing him down the road? Who would you like to see him fighting? I think he's going to be in great fights. I mean, I like the Dillian White fight. I like the Luis Ortiz fight. I mean, the Usyk fight would be a big fight for New York or for, for Chicago. You know, he's kind of stepping up to the level now where he's going to be in some tough fights, but he's ready. Who's it? Who you see him on the, on the platform? He's going to be fighting either Takam or Povetkin, someone like that, on May 18 in Chicago. In Chicago. Uh, Povetkin will be on that card whether he's fighting Usyk or someone else. Uh, Hergovic will probably be on that card as well. Um, Callum Smith may be defending his world title on that card, so it's going to be a big night. A lot of boxing, a lot of boxing. Yeah. big one, Anthony Joshua, Jarrell Miller. Yeah. We've seen what the drama went down here in New York City, but then in England, Big Bang Miller went down to step yeah, just, all right. Yeah, no, I think I think you know he went a bit crazy over here, and you know we need to make sure that obviously things don't go too far physically. But it's a big fight, you know, had a big build up, and a lot of people are going to be very interested, and you know, I've sold over thirteen thousand tickets at MSG already for that fight. A couple last words for your fans worldwide, Eddie. Just don't miss it. Don't miss the matchroom schedule. It's all over the place. We've got Milan on Friday night, we've got Turning Stone on Saturday, we've got Philly next Friday. It just don't stop. Thank you, sir.